Hi guys, I'm Mar, and I clearly spend way too much time on TikTok. I feel pretty much 90% of my videos start by me saying I shouldn't have seen this on TikTok, but I did. And now we just have to figure out if it's true or not. We must get to the bottom of this. And also, really, any excuse is a good excuse to shop. So hey, here we are. One of my late TikTok nights, I came across the Sephora employee, but she was recommending her top products, and I felt that this was a really good way to basically get a Sephora employee to pick products for me. Sure, she wouldn't know what my skin is, who I am, but she will be able to tell us her favorites and not really having to meet any sales goals or anything. Pretty much, this is the best way to get an honest Sephora employee. So here we go. Here's the TikTok. These are the products. Hopefully, I didn't mess up when I was buying them because just leave it to me, honey. If I can mess something up, I probably will. Top five products from a Sephora employee check. The Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow Night Serum will help get rid of any skin texture. These Dr. Jart micro tip patches will get rid of any dark spots and blemishes on the face. Kat Von D smoothing powder will leave your skin flawless every time. Pat McGrath's lip pencil in the shade contour is the best for the perfect pout. Excuse the tester, but Milk's highlighter in the shade glitz is the best perfect pink glittery highlight all right there we have it i placed my sephora order and i got a bunch of things most of these products i was not familiar with so i can tell you i've been trying them and i got tea to spill also i got another sample this time i realized it's for hair not like when i did that sephora versus ulta video where i literally sprayed whatever it was on my face I'm telling you, I cannot be trusted. Let's start with this pharmacy honeymoon glow, honey, because we want to be glowing. Is there anything that we want to do more than glow? Maybe have a sugar daddy, but I'll settle for the glow. Even though the price is steep, you might need a sugar daddy to buy it. <laughs> Or just a job, girl. Treat yourself. You're worth it. If there's something you want to invest on, is your skincare. Trust me, it's time for an eye cream. Especially if your childhood crush had a haircut that was something similar to this. Girl, the eye cream is calling you. So I started using this product. So here I have my Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow. I'm about to test this out for first time ever. AHA Resurfacing Night Serum. Okay, we gotta be resurfaced. It says one to two pumps, two to three times a week. This smells kind of funky, but it does claim to get a smoother, younger skin. So I'm just like, maybe we should do more like 20 pumps. It tingles, but just the slightest bit. Look at my skin. Is it smooth already? The next day. Guys, so this is my skin. Morning after, literally from bed. We have a great protection here, but I mean, I don't see any difference right now, but I've only used the product for one day. Hopefully we'll be seeing some improvement throughout this week. And the next day I woke up from using it, I was kind of like, where's the glow at? Where's the magic? Is it happening? When's it coming? But girl, I would say about two uses into it. So about three days after my first use, <gasps> I woke up and I was like, whoa, my skin looking good today. It literally felt like it was glowing. And I was like, I wonder what it is. I guess I'm just beautiful this morning. <laughs> Just casual. And then I remember I had added this product to my skincare routine. So it's a good one. I am very happy with it. Well, I'm only about a week in, so I can't be like life changing. I don't really know. But I can say definitely I saw it. I saw my glow. It was not just my natural musk, honey. TikTok coming through. Next up, I'm just gonna put it out there because the first thing I saw was why are we supporting Kat Von D? Why are we supporting an anti-vaxxer? Why am I even holding this product? I mean, really in this current world, in this current climate, I'm like anti-vaxxer. Kat Von D, who? Don't know her. Mm. I'm sorry. I just had to be vocal about this. So I was pretty confused. I did give the powder a try and a fair try. Here I have this Kat Von D. Okay. Presentation. Very nice. Oh, it's really pretty. Here's this powder. I'm going to try and apply some with... Oh, you just put it on my hand. Oh, that's a lot of coverage. It's just a lot. Oh God. My makeup's going to be set for life. I feel like it's just never going to come off with this. I think this powder is really good if you like your makeup to be like on you know not dewy just set forever and ever it looks really matte wow that looks nice guys it's so good it's very good i really like this powder and then i started doing some research and apparently kat von d is no longer part of kvd beauty and she's not really profiting from the brand so if you buy this brand you're not supporting her if you don't want to support her you do you whatever you want as long as you're vaccinating your children now on to these focus spot wow these are weird so weird so they make these for different areas i decided to get the dark circle and also for dark spot because i have both of those i'm just dark all over dark 
dark circles, dark spots, dark humor. It's just me. And I was ready to give these a go until I read the instructions. So you're apparently supposed to apply these for two hours and ideally leave them on overnight. And they are really advanced. They just look really fabulous. This feels like it's gonna get the work done. All right, I'm about to try this. I just took out one little patch. Well, I guess two little patches. They look hella expensive. This luxury right here. Mm, this a Costco premium membership. So this says to remove the white and then apply right under the eye, but not touch. Ooh, this is like a full on stick. Okay, okay. Wow, that's really stuck on there. I feel like I'm blinking kind of funny right now. Like I can't close my eye properly. <laughs> I know. It feels like something's pulling on my eye. That's how secure this is. So moving the border. Whoa, this is so cool. Here we go. And now we put this other bat boy on. I'm gonna put it a little bit lower just so I can actually blink. Here we go. Looking fabulous. Ready for my pillow. Now I'm gonna use this patch for my dark spot. I have a really dark spot here, so it's perfect. Hopefully, it'll be gone by the morning. You get a lot more of these than you get the under eye one. Hmm. Wait, it's so small. What? What am I even gonna do with that? That's so tiny. Excuse me, sir. I need like 10 of these. I feel the little kind of needle things on my skin. That's crazy. Probably why it tells you not to press down because it feels like something poking at your skin. I'm just gonna take an extra one and I'm gonna use it on this freckle right here. And tomorrow we can see if it's lighter. Maybe. Who knows? Fabulous. So I slept in these bad boys and when I woke up, it was definitely not what I asked for. So I ended up with these yellow stains under my eyes for the whole day. I was literally in the middle of the day and someone asked, what's wrong with your eyes? Why are you bruising? What? Bruising? So these definitely didn't work. I didn't really see any improvement with this one. And also they're just way too small. What kind of dark spot is that that's so tiny? I don't understand why I make them so small. They put six in there. I would have rather them just put like three decently sized ones. And for the money, cause these are expensive. I did not find them worth it at all. I don't know what the reviews say. And I honestly don't care. Cause I know this brand is good and they can do better. Excuse the tester, but Milk's highlighter in the shade Glitz is the perfect pink glittery highlight so hold up she said glitz i was looking for glitz on the sephora website and i could not find glitz i found glitz and i was like oh that's what she meant she meant blitz where i thought i just didn't understand her right because my hearing's off it's starting to go with age i don't know maybe i hurt her wrong again but i tried this highlighter oh girl oh girl this highlighter are you ready to be blinded here i have my flex the packaging is very cute very sleek Ooh, it's so pretty it's so shiny all right i'm gonna do a little swatch with my finger that's beautiful it's a gorgeous color i feel this type of color goes well with a lot of skin tones which is amazing and just look how shiny that is that's amazing i love it i'm just gonna apply this how i would usually do with any highlight let's see Woo! that was a light oh my god that's a lot it's beautiful you definitely need kind of a light hand with this at least if you're one of those people kind of like i am i love my highlighter but i like it to look you know like i'm just dewy like i'm looking cute not like i put on a whole bunch of highlighter i'm just like trying to blind you and tell you to check out my instagram you know what i mean that looks so cute wow so the way i usually apply my highlighter is to mist my face you know what not mist drench my face with some setting spray and my favorite is urban decay all nighter although i gotta say i've also been using this pixie one because i'm only gonna be home i don't really need to go anywhere my makeup doesn't really have to be set so i'm saving the expensive stuff for later <laughs> you know what i mean so let me just use this one and quickly i'll apply my highlighter and that usually makes it pop oh, oh my god i'm looking like a little glazed donut wow that's kind of a lot for me but i know that look is something you know a lot of people love i prefer this side i feel for this highlighter in particular you don't need to do anything to make it pop it just pops now you can see my cheeks from outer space basically i just love it it's a lot i feel like this is just one of those products that makes you look young makes you look skinny it's just like yes honey i love you and then we have this pat mcgrath permagel liner girl this is 
28 dollars 28 excuse you gotta work for like two hours to buy this what it does come in this really fancy luxurious packaging i love my pat mcgrath you guys know i do you guys know the foundation i have it right here i actually got multiple it's everything to me powder pat mcgrath is for when you're treating yourself or when you got your bills paid or when you got that stimulus check in the mail that's when pat mcgrath comes in so i'm just gonna open this it just feels so fabulous Ooh, here's the liner and then it also comes with the sharpener wow really 20 dollars and you can't just come out oh there's no way i'm destroying this box i'm keeping it just to remember that i bought this i'm not joking here's the box from my foundation i guess i don't really need the sharpener right now so i'm gonna try this liner my lips are a mess let's see the shade it's like a brown color it's a lot less pinky than what i usually wear i usually wear something a lot more pink let's see okay it's really soft for 28 dollars this lip liner better fill my lips feel like lipstick it better be like lip injections mm, it feels so good it really has an amazing texture so i don't know how i feel about the color it's really not very me it feels really good it feels creamy honestly you can use this as a lipstick but the color i'm just not sure about but yeah tell me what do you guys think if i only had to get one of these products wow it's hard okay my top three from this top five is the pharmacy honeymoon glow the milk highlighter and this lip liner i might prefer another shade but the actual formula is flawless i love it but you guys let me know what you think also if you have any favorite products let me know because i want to try them and any excuse is a good excuse for shopping thank you so much guys i'll see you in the next one